All right, I'm Kyle Mishka, student here at Michigan Technological University studying material science and engineering. And our senior design project was on a corrosion study for aluminum change in automotive wiring, mainly focused on bus bars, which are the circuit components found in your fuse box. Uh, we investigated uh, this project for Yuzaki North America. And what we did was look at if they change from the current copper uh, alloy used to aluminum, what would the problems be associated with it? We found that this change in their current process, which involves a plated material on top of the aluminum alloy, or the current case copper, it would lead to what they call micro-cracking, and that's a breakdown of the plating that exposes the two metal system, so the aluminum bus bar, and then whatever plating material will be on top of it, uh, and that would lead to galvanic corrosion. In our case, we investigated three possible plating materials, zinc, tin, and nickel, and we ran them through a series of tests. Uh, different ASTM standards, bend tests, and salt fog exposure as, long as, as well as potential dynamic polarization. And the results that we found are that in the current process, the aluminum is not a good substitute right now for the copper. The process would have to be changed in order for this material change to go through. Um, why we investigated this, some uh, potential savings for Izaki would be uh, weight. Aluminum in this case would be 50% lighter than the copper, and with cars needing to be more and more fuel efficient, that weight savings would be significant for the automotive manufacturers.